Hello, and now I'm going to call something called constructing a 90-degree angle by the, the skill is dropping a perpendicular. Not dropping a microphone, but dropping a perpendicular. So I start on GeoGebra, the GeoGebra suite, with a segment. The segment can be any length you want it to be, and then a point on, the segment, on that segment, that so you can go anywhere you want. I now need to have a circle with a radius, and it doesn't really matter how big it is, as long as it's the, the circle, the arcs of the circumference of the circle are encompassed by the segment we've made. So let me put a radius of four. That will work nicely. I now need to do the intersection points of the circle with the segment, which will give me D and E. I now no longer need that circle, so I'm going to change the colour, and a nice light blue would work nicely there. I go for circles center radius for D and E, and all I need to make sure is the, the circle goes beyond C, so let me try with a radius of 5, to see if it's too big, no, 5 is wonderful. I do exactly the same again, it has to be 5, it has to be the same radius, and now I do the intersection points of these two larger circles, F, G, and my intersection points of those, I connect, and I now have my 90 degree angles. I do just get rid of my constructions, uh, not really get rid, but uh, change the colour, and um, I have myself a 90 degree angle at C. Um, if you want to see how that works, I just get my angle, and I do D, C, F, and there's 90 degrees, and that's it, uh, that's it done.